Did the president during this conversation address the latest comments uh, Prime Minister Netanyahu made saying that uh, Lebanon could uh, experience the same level of destruction as Gaza if they don't free themselves from Hezbollah? So look, um, as I stated, um, they had a productive and honest conversation. Uh, but what I will say very clearly about that particular question is we, uh, we cannot and will not uh, see Lebanon turn into Gaza, into another Gaza. Does the White House have any guarantee that Israel will not bomb Beirut airport? So look, we're going to have very direct uh, conversations with the government of Israel uh, about the shape and the nature as we speak about Lebanon specifically, right, uh, and the ultimate sc scope of their campaign. Uh, and uh, those conversations are going to continue, uh, and I'm not going to get into specific conversations that we're having. Um, in two weeks, there is already eight hospitals in Lebanon are out of service. There is thousands of being, people being killed. Mm -hmm. There is one million forced to flee their homes, and yeah. the Israelis has calling for more troops. So how can this not be a scenario in Gaza? Uh, look, I'm going to uh, say what I said moments ago. We do not want to see Gaza what happened in Gaza happened in Lebanon. I, that's what I said, and that is something that we do not want to see. Uh, and as we've said, Israel does have the right to defend itself. 